what we have here guys is an air hogs wind flyer I think that's what it's called originally it had I think it was NICAD batteries in it that you charged up and then flew I modified that to just a super capacitor so it's probably slightly less voltage and this runs for a few seconds as you can see so we charge it up by attaching the battery to the terminals on the supercapacitor. They're connected straight through to the motor, so the motor spins up and when it's spinning as fast as it can go, you know the supercapacitor is fully charged. And then we throw it. Now the modification that I've done, I've got a bent paper clip there that goes right through the body to hold it. That's more or less on the centre of gravity line. And then we've got a little um, loop at the end here, another piece of bent paper clip, slightly back so that the plane will tend to point outwards. And I've also got a bit of weight on the outside wing so the idea is it should tend to turn outwards and lean outwards because if you have it turning that way it will naturally lift straight into the middle of the circle. Then that's a good bit of um, kite string there strong stuff and in the middle we've got a swing tennis set that we're using that just pushes nicely into my garden I've got a fishing swivel on there to connect it together and that's what we're doing we're doing a few seconds of power with a super capacitor and going round the pole or tethered flight if we still had the original battery, which wouldn't actually take charge, but if it was in good condition, then it'd probably run for quite a bit longer. But as it is, we're just running it round on 10 farads, 2.7 volts. Just for a bit of fun, in the garden. The only thing I've got is that plant there sticks in just a bit too far, so I've had to push it back so I can get maximum radius in my garden. Just walk over this way. We're pretty close to my shed, within about six inches of it. Plenty of room there, but down here we would actually hit the hedge if I don't push it back. It's not powerful enough for me to stick a little um, camera on it, so we're not going to be doing that today. But there we go, round the pole, tethered flight in my garden with an air hogs. As I say, I think it's called a wind flyer. Hey, thanks for watching. There's plenty of videos on my main channel with more added daily. 
so don't forget to subscribe and enable the notifications to keep you up to date with my new releases. My second channel, Grandad's Other Channel, is where I put the longer videos with more detail. Then there's my Facebook page and you can follow me on Twitter. You can help keep my channel running by donating a dollar on Patreon to buy me coffee. And if you fancy some Grandad merchandise, I have two shops, one on Redbubble and the other on Cotton Car. Finally, you can always find more information in the video description. Thanks again for watching.